guys, this is Dude Collar from Bridge Street Mining Company. I thought we'd do an episode where we looked in on uh, son of Dude Collar's sister, Jamie, who is an entertainer and lives in the apartment where they just moved out of. They have that swanky new apartment. This guy is still a douchebag. They were fighting and it was bothering her. So she is going to complain angrily about the noise and maybe they'll have a nice little fight. <laughs> you know what? It's never fun when they apologize. Alright, so what can we do now? Um. Well, we can go to the bathroom. So this is Jamie's apartment. I don't know if we ever did an episode over here. Uh, we moved her out because I wanted the... I wanted little dude and um, Marina to be able to have a little family. And um, they actually moved out because that apartment was full of bugs. And they were making good money. She's doing okay. She's not doing great. She's doing better than her better than her parents, though. Um, I don't know. I feel like Dude and Jade only ever had like two or three thousand dollars at the most. Um, so is this going away? Oh, good. Decorated. Oh, because we have a decorated Thank apartment. You. Um, okay. Let's see if there's a festival right now. That is a mirror, not, not a festival poster. There it is. Nope, no festivals. So the last episode, I believe, we played some nice basketball, and that was kind of fun. I like the basketball interactions with the new um, city, city living. It's part, kind of cool. Um, let's see if Jamie's met anybody that she can be friends with. In the time that, uh, since we left her. He's obviously not going to be friends with him. Um. Atharv Basu. Do any of these guys look good enough for our Jamie? I don't think so. Gita Rosoya. Is a ghost. Hey, there's Marina's sister. There's Marina. Oh, they're not very good friends. Oh, that's right. She kind of pissed her off a couple times. Um, Bako Jang. That sounds like a Star Wars name. Courtney LeBlanc. See, I don't know some of these people. There's uh, new characters since I installed the city living thing. Uh, so we should probably go out somewhere with some of these people. Darius Friend. She's known for a while. Damien Khan. He looks like a kind of a... I don't know. She's friends with this Rick guy. And I'm not really sure how. Let's send him a happy text. And then let's... Can she like... Invite club to hang out. He's not in her club. Club cosplay. She's not in club cosplay, is she? No, she's in... She has her workout buds. Um, Okay. Let's see. Oh, now she's making food. Don't burn the house down, idiot. Ah. So does she have... Did anyone move oh. into little dude's apartment yet? Nope. No one's available. No one's over there. Just out of curiosity, I want to see what's in her family inventory, if anything. Nothing. Okay. That's interesting. What the heck is she making? She makes some kind of spaghetti or something? I guess. That might be new with the dine out thing. <sighs> Dinner for one. How lonely. And she is... She's an adult. 
I don't know. I don't remember if I aged her up or not. I don't think I did. She was quite a bit younger than little dude. So she must have aged up on her own. Sometimes it doesn't really sync up very well. She doesn't have any bills, does she? I don't think so. Huh, Barrage. All right. Um. Let's travel somewhere with one of these guys and see if she can spark something. Um, do do do. Rick Spear, he looks okay. Let's travel someplace with Rick Spear. Oh, it's two in the morning. He's probably going to yell at her for calling. Rick is sleeping. <laughs> okay, we'll forget about that. We'll call him in the morning. All right, let's just have her sleep. I'll probably break away and come back to you in, in, when I uh, when it's more appropriate time of day. All right, as planned, we are going to go someplace with Rick Spear and see what happens. Hey, they're hugging. That's so nice. They just met. Rick will see you there. I don't know how they became friends. I don't. I don't remember her meeting him. They might have met like. Um, oh, he's got kind of a paunch. <laughs> this fat guy. <laughs> okay. Um, doesn't mean he's not a good guy, I guess. Um, karaoke bar. I don't want to go there. Let's go to a different spot. We'll go here. All right, here we go. Rick Spear. <sighs> hey, Rick. No, I'm not giving him an apartment key yet. Jeez. Why does that even come up? <laughs> Clanky. Ooh, lack. He's kind of funny looking. Ina. I um, really should uh, invite him to join the workout, buds. Joke about gross food, that's funny. <laughs> One who wants so. That doesn't look like a healthy conversation. Slapping silly. I love it. Oh, flash crazy eyes. Yumba yum kwaiba. I love it. Ha <laughs> <laughs> you smacked the crap out of me. Makes no sense. <laughs> yeah, you're crazy. You're crazy, lady. Um Oh, Rick is childish too. Well of course that makes sense. Oh oh hey. Grim Death isn't here. Hogging the microphone. Let's try and use it. Alright, so she hasn't written a comedy routine, so she can't do that. Uh, let's have her tell jokes. Oh, shit. Guess I have to have her write a... Whoa, that was a swear word. At least it sounded like one. I know it wasn't, but... Oops, oops. So that sounds like, I believe, Sims 2 music. <laughs> Idiot. <laughs> Zarbul! 
Hey, we're getting some laughs. Look at that. Hey, look, we're we're getting a crowd here. Hey, why'd that lady leave? I don't know. Oh, she's about to gain. Okay. Hey, reached comedy level four. All right, let's take a break from this and go talk to the guy she came with. Okay, guy. What's going on? Share conspiracy theory. Uh, she's getting a little mischievous here. Let's see how this conspiracy theory thing goes. Uh, she just looks crazy. Instill with false confidence. That was kind of mean. Uh-oh, uh-oh, she has to go to the bathroom, I didn't realize. Where bathroom? There we go. Go cool. use the bathroom, dummy. Cool. Wait, I can't tell. With the walls down, you can't tell which is the men's room. I kind of don't like that. Alright, let's get rid of that. Get rid of that so you can go use the bathroom. Oh, who's this, who's this douchebag? Oh, is that the guy that was laughing at her? Calvin Chamberlain. Quite a beard you have there, sir. Who's this lady? Oh, I thought she. Oh, she. Yeah, she's gonna play the uh, violin. Let's see if she's any good. Oh, yeah, she is. Oh, she's an entertainer. Nice. Alright, let's introduce ourselves to some of these people. Claim to be a criminal mastermind. Let's tell a knock knock joke. Who's this guy? Do we know him, I guess. Kelvin Chamberlain. Complimentary colors. Ooh, we don't know what his job is. It's really tempting to do all the obnoxious things. Joke about toilets. Hanka, Vazif, Schwabi from Vanage. Burpando? We'll try and start a preposterous Pando. rumor just for fun. Hey. <laughs> Hey's a music lover. That's not bad. She has music characteristics too, right? No, she doesn't. <laughs> she doesn't at all. But she is an entertainer. Oh, he got mad. Oh, get over dag, it. Dag. Jeez. Dag, dag, you suck. So. Oh, 
All right, we're gonna go home. <sighs> Jamie didn't really make much progress meeting a um, anyone who could be, you know. Oh, Rick Spear. Hey, I need to get out of the house. Want to join me for dinner at Hogan's Burger Bar? No, nah, no. Nah. You just went out with her. You left, douchebag. So guys, that's going to do it for this episode of Sim The Sims 4, The Life of Dude Collar. There's a look at the city living pack. Um, we focused a little bit on Jamie this time, just because we haven't in a while. Um, and I kind of miss her now that they're all split up. But um, anyways, next episode is going to be Little Dude and the family. We'll see how Brianna's doing and everything. Uh, I should check because sometimes it ages people up when they're not supposed to. Uh, no, Brianna's still the right age. She's still a child. It's always a risk to play a different family in this game. Seems alright, though. Alright, guys. Thanks for watching. Have a great day, everybody. Bye! Whoa. <laughs>